Hey, what's going on everybody? Hey, listen, I want to thank you guys for taking time to be here watching this video. I realize you guys could be doing a million and one other things, but you're watching this video, you're learning how to trade Forex, you're learning a new perspective on trading Forex, or how to think differently than what you're used to uh, around Forex. So I want to thank you guys for being here today. Now, I, I realize that you guys are coming from all across the world, you're watching this video, as I always tell you guys, if you're not yet connected with me on Facebook, on Instagram, get connected, okay? If you're not yet subscribed to this channel right here, but you're watching this video, as you do all other videos that I may put out, why? Why not get subscribed? Get subscribed to this channel, okay? It's only going to benefit you, all right? Now listen, I want to tell you guys... This video today is going to be about how to become a conditional trader. And I know that most of you may ask, well, what is a conditional trader? So let me tell you, a conditional trader, that's what I consider myself, I'm one of those people who I'm not looking for or I'm not using a thousand different things in order for me to get into the market or indicators or um, I'm not looking for you know, a, a, a lot of, or let's say a number of different um, types of setups for me to get into the market, okay? Those days are over. I'm looking for a couple different setups to get into the market. And then in those setups, I'm looking for a few conditions to be met before I enter the market. That's it. I'm keeping it very simple. Because as a long-term trader, you guys must, I guess by now, you must know that I'm a long-term trader at heart. At this point in my journey, long-term trading is by far more profitable for me, okay? You know, it allows me to, to live a certain lifestyle that, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't change, I wouldn't trade for anything, okay? It gives me peace of mind, I'm not stressed out, so... With that, there are a few conditions that I look for in the market. If the market isn't responding or presenting these conditions, if they're not met, I keep it moving. Find something else to do. You know, look at another chart. If that isn't working, I find something else to do. I look at another chart. If that isn't working, I look at every chart for this setup to be, um, you know, to have these conditions met. If I don't find it, then I keep it moving. I go find something else to do. And that's one of the, um, when you're talking about discipline, that's one of the things that traders, they, they lack. They lack discipline because people are taught a lot of different ways of doing things and then you don't never create one of your own. So me, I've developed a certain discipline that I follow. So that has helped me a lot. It has helped me become an awesome trainer, mentor, uh, to my students from all across the world has helped me do this thing called training people, mentoring people into becoming a better trader. Just Not even just in Forex, just outside of that. So I want to tell you guys, um, become a conditional trader. Become a conditional trader. You'll find that with that, it's going to, it's going to allow you to uh, be more, I guess, I guess I'll say confident because you know, you know what, this condition, these conditions that I'm waiting for to set up, while they, they may not happen all the time, when they happen, I know that the level of probability is going to be much higher. It's not going to be randomly happening. It's going to happen every so often, but enough for me to be prosperous and profitable and to hold me over until I get the next one. And that's the key. You know, we could trade all day long. You know, my, my thing is if I open up a thousand trades a day, I, I'm exposed myself to a, a heightened level of risk. But when I decrease that factor, some may say, well, you're not going to make that much. I beg to differ. Because the type of setup that I'm looking for it, 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 it allows for a, a, a far greater reward than opening up a thousand trades, wasting all my day, and subjecting myself to a higher level 
of risk. That's just the way I trade. I'm a conditional trader. So um, without giving you guys a really long video, a real drawn out, I want to sort of scratch the surface on the topic of really it's about discipline, but being a conditional trader. Okay? Hopefully you guys have taken something away from this. You know, sit back and think about how how you open up your trades, uh, what you're looking for to get into the market, and ask yourself, am I all over the place? Am I looking for a thousand things to happen before I get into the market? Or am I simplifying things and, and, and looking for, you know, one two punch and then I'm in. You know, so think about it. It's not just you gotta think deeply, okay, and think hard on what it is that you're trying to um, you know what I guess your goal you gotta think hard on it and, and realize that you can't get to that goal by being all over the place keep it simple go after the one-two punch let that thing ride trust me when I tell you I'm living proof baby alright so listen you guys as always you guys know my name is Yusuf Scott also consider it the forest goat I want you guys to take heed to this message here I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.